Friends, let's break down this first assignment that you'll be using an LCD display with. So it's going to be the Arduino and the LCD being partners in this exciting opportunity for you. Uh, this is all going to be in Tinkercad. No real Arduino needed for this one, but don't worry, you'll be using lots of LCD displays in the future. Um, you're going to get to wire up an LCD display in Tinkercad. So you'll need an Arduino and a breadboard. Grab a resistor and make it 220 ohms. That's the one with the red, red, brown stripes. You'll need an LCD display and, hey, some wires. So part one is to meditate and study this diagram. I'll click on it so you can see it a little bit larger. Uh, the wiring is not impossible. There's a lot of wires, a lot of colors, but it's worth your time because then you get to have an LCD display as part of your circuit and program. So take your time, breathe occasionally, stand up, stretch, and get everything wired. It's not as crazy as it looks, and notice that you are still left with some open pins for other inputs and outputs in your circuit. Do pay close attention to which pins are being used. It's 12 and 11 and then 5, 4, 3, and 2 because those are referenced in the sample code that I have provided you with. <clears throat> Excuse me. Once you get it all wired up, enter in this code below. <clears throat> and also be sure to watch the attached video that breaks down how the code works. What do all these numbers mean? What does LCD print mean? What does LCD set cursor mean? What does LCD.begin mean? Watch my video on that. It'll make your life even better. Part two is what you're actually going to turn in. So you're going to take this circuit and you're going to wire in an LED like this. There's the LED. You want a free preview of how you wire it in? There you go. Now, you observant person, you are noticing that it is cycling through. It says my name, waits a second, says red on, then red off, then my name, then red on, you get it. You'll notice that when the red LED turns on, it actually says red on. When the LED turns off, it says red off, and it loops through this forever. You, brave programmer, get to figure out, okay, how am I going to program this so it displays the message at the same time that the LED is on? Well, here's my hint, although you'll notice it's not in code because you have to figure out the code. But you're going to show your name first. Then it's going to wait, I said half a second, but let's make it a full second, right? Then it turns the LED on. Then it the LCD will display red on, then it will wait a second, then it will turn the LCD off, and then it will turn off, then it will turn off the LED, then it will turn off the LCD, then it will wait half a second, and it will loop back to the top and repeat this over and over and over again. Um, I would recommend you color code your wires. I know some of you like to work within a single color aesthetic. But man, that gets a little crazy when you're trying to keep track of which wire goes where. So that is my story on this assignment. You will turn in the Tinkercad share link as proof of your success. And I look forward to seeing your work. Thanks for watching and have a great day.